Eating frugally for a family of four. Well, you think it's a challenge? Food Lion put that to the test. Some bloggers, and they had them come up with low cost, good food, fresh food, feeding a family for four, under 15 bucks. Can you do it? Well, these creative ladies have come up to the challenge, and they're here now to help us show some award winning recipes. We've got uh, Liza, we've got Ronnie, we've got, are you all bloggers, and you are? Sarah. Sarah. All right. Well, Let's get right to it. What did you cook up for that? Well, we, um, we ended up cooking three different things, all um, pretty simple. The main part of it is a stuffed pork chop, and we'll sort of throw that together. Okay, that's okay. let's see. Let's take it. Um, it's very easy. Just warmed some olive oil uh, in a pan and added chopped onions. We added some chopped apple. Nice. So that would be great for fall. As yeah, it's I don't think of apple with a stuffed pork, but that's a nice touch. Yep, okay. Yep, like pork chops and applesauce. Mm -hmm. um, and then we also added a little bit of finely chopped carrot. Good. All healthy thus far. All healthy. <laughs> and then some chopped garlic. So you kind of just over medium heat, saute that up till it gets nice and soft. And then after um, the onions sort of get translucent, then all you do is you add in some fresh spinach that's been chopped up. And it looks like a lot, but as it warms up in a couple of minutes, it will actually wilt down um, to about half the size. And uh, so another couple of minutes, you cook that up and then finish it off with some fresh parsley. And then through the magic of TV, it looks something like this, huh? <laughs> it looks like this. So you can really see actually how it melts down. Yes. Um, and so now this is your stuffing for your pork. And for your pork chop, you could just get um, standard boneless pork chop, even cut out any visible fat if you want to kind of reduce the fat. Pound it with a mallet until mm -hmm. it's a little bit thinner. And then you can just take a little bit of your stuffing and stick it. And right in the middle. And this was all done for under, like you feed a family for four, all 15 bucks of so the pork chops. I would think the pork is the most expensive of the ingredients, mm -hmm. but still, mm -hmm. that's uh, still manageable. Under, yeah. yeah. And they're all really pantry items. I mean, a lot of the things yeah. that we used were mm -hmm. things that you would keep on hand that you can use in your pantry for other dishes as well. So okay. it's kind of nice. So once you add a little um, stuffing to your pork chop, you can literally just roll it. And this kind of makes it a little fancier than it's yeah, standard. Yeah, it looks uh, class. And it looks, yeah, yeah it, it looks does. like a lot of work, but it's really not. Huh. You roll it in the stuffing in there, and then you can dip it in a little egg wash. And then, uh, yeah. And then get a little breadcrumbs crumb. on it. And then um, just a standard cookie sheet with a little nonstick cooking spray. Um, you throw it in the oven and maybe sprinkle a little olive oil on it. It'll help kind of crisp it up a little yeah. bit. Yeah, and that's um, the finished product over that's there. That's the finished product, yeah. Yep. Wow, so you all blogged uh, this, Food Lion rewarded you with it, and it's easy enough for all of us to try at home. There's nothing really, like you said, pantry items, and buying some of the pork uh, Food Lion, you're good to go. Yep. We'll check out the blog, and we'll have more information on our website, Fox 45 Baltimore. Thanks, ladies, for Great, coming thank by. You. Thank you. Terrific.